Researching toilets, huh? Need to find a place to put your bodily fluids? I might have a solution for you. All right, come on in. Okay, so let's just get into the nitty gritty on what the Laveo Dry Flush Toilet is. So basically the toilet is made by a company called Laveo and it is a dry flush toilet. So it's basically what the name implies. It's basically a toilet that you flush that is completely dry, no water is used. So basically my toilet is situated at the bottom of like the closet on two 500 pound drawer slides. So it's hidden, slides out like this. And basically the toilet, you could literally take it out, literally by hand if you wanted to, right? And you can literally just plop it pretty much anywhere convenient. So you don't need to have any type of ducting or plumbing. It's very nice in that way because it's very, uh, you know, compatible to whatever space you have. Now, so that it doesn't slide around, I have these uh, kind of like foam pieces that I kind of wedge in between here so that it doesn't move or slide or anything like that. I wanted it like that so that basically the toilet can be charged. So we're gonna open up the lid here. We have a Mylar bag material. I believe it's about 17 feet of bag. And basically what that is, and actually I'm gonna take out the toilet seat that we're all used to. You open that up, plastic, um, under plastic carriage, which sits right on top of the cartridge of Mylar. And basically, it is a baggie and it ties up everything. And you never actually see any waste at all ever in your life. It's awesome. So what happens is when you use it, you're gonna basically just go to the bathroom like you would. Now, solids, not a problem. When it comes to liquids, it actually comes with this brilliant stuff called pea powder. So basically you sprinkle this on the liquid and it solidifies it. And so you basically, the only time you'll ever have to really see your waste is when you are kind of waiting for that uh, pea powder to kind of like dry it all up and then you flush it bada bing bada boom it does its magic it's really cool okay, cut to the b-roll of the laveo in action That's a great toilet. Gotta say, I honestly love this toilet. Some of you guys may, might be thinking like, what are the drawbacks? There's a couple. One, it's not cheap, okay? So this toilet, if you're willing to fork up the money, it's so worth it, but it's, it's, it's not that cheap. Second thing is it's probably not the most eco-friendly uh, product because of the Mylar material. You know, you just kind of throw it away. So that's, I don't know, more more waste in the uh, atmosphere, trash, I don't know. But think about how much plastic and trash you consume anyway. It's, it's not that much, um, in my opinion. The third thing is that the cartridges also cost. That's, that's really where they get you. I think you get about 15 to 17 flushes. When you go number one, you use the pea powder and you, it dries up that you could actually, you know, go pee like three times before you actually need to flush it. But if you just never want to see it or deal with it or whatever, like, you know, you're just going to have to use more flushes. You really want to use bathrooms outside of your van whenever you can, but definitely in cases of emergency, like definitely a luxury to have, especially when you don't have like the smell factors and the, just the ease of installation. I think it's a great product. All the pros that I know are using this. There's really not much else to say other than it's freaking magic for your poo. If you guys like the toilet and want to help support the channel and me and my dreams come true, uh, please click on the link 
in the description for the Laveo. It's basically an Amazon affiliate link. If you want to buy the toilet, if you buy it through that link, that would really, really help me out. Appreciate that. If you don't do it, no worries, no hard feelings. I still love you. Uh, thank you so much for watching the video. And yeah, please leave me, leave me any feedback, any comments. I respond to every comment I get to the best of my abilities. And yeah, let me know if you guys like the review or if there's anything I was missing because I want to I want to improve and uh, get back into posting regularly on YouTube. So thank you so much. I uh, look forward to talking with you. Also, add me on Instagram if you like. And, uh, you know, feel free to ask me any questions uh, on there about anything van life uh, related. Looking forward to speaking with you guys and getting back into the swing of things.